you? What the hell do you want from us? Lee, what's going on? I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Kenny? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. We only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Will you search it if you wanna? I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place one I more- I said I'm done with this house! We can do both. Ben, you take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful, while me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Clem, honey, I, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know, it. it's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Ich kann sie doch nicht in Gefahr bringen. burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. Wir können das Mede doch nicht einfach so in Gefahr so bringen. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Ja. No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? Ja. Great. Just great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. Confidence is earned, Ben. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you pulled. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Ernsthaft auch noch sauer auf uns sein? Nach allem, was du verbockt hast, bist du auch noch sauer auf uns? Junge, sei froh, dass ich dich nicht zurückgelassen habe, wie ich es mit der Militärtrolle gemacht habe. Sei froh, dass du noch an unserer Seite mitlaufen darfst. Hm, die haben das Auto gut ausgeschlachtet. Talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? Oh, Kenny. I mean, the river's right up ahead. Eigentlich müsste ich Angst haben, weil er Kenny heißt. Ich meine, South Park. Bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. What in the hell is going on? I don't 
know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. Hm. Let's keep moving. Wie gesagt, das ist mir gar nicht so richtig bewusst geworden, aber wenn ich an South Park denke, mein Gott, sie haben Kenny getötet, ihr Schweine! Dann müsste ich mir ja eigentlich um unseren Kenny Sorgen machen. I think we're oh my God. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Kenny man, let's just go back to the house and tell the others. Come up with a new plan. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Ah, oh, es war so klar, dass viele Leute viel früher, viel eher auf die Idee gekommen sind mit dem Boot, dass natürlich kein Boot mehr da ist, was man benutzen kann. This one might still be salvageable. You better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. Was? Du bist Fischer. Perfekt. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Das ist gar nicht mal ein schlechter Plan, Kollege. Und ich muss mich mal ein bisschen bequemer hinsetzen. Ne. Kein Moment. So, Moment, wir machen mal kurz Pause. Machen wir es uns hier mal ein bisschen gerade bequemer. Ich mache mir echt Sorgen um Kenny. Ich mache mir echt Sorgen, so wie er aktuell drauf ist. So. Ja. So geht's wieder. Okay, wir können weiterspielen. Und nein, ich habe mich nicht nur ein bisschen versucht vor dem Ganzen hier zu drücken, weil das ja vielleicht noch ordentlich in die Hose gehen könnte. Ich doch nicht. Jesus. Schon beunruhigend, wie ausgestorben die Stadt aussieht. It's an old cash register. Not much use these days. Ja, stimmt. Geld ist sinnfrei jetzt. Aber, oh. Was sind diese Markierungen eigentlich? What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Das ist mal interessant. Da sind noch mehr. Is this meant to be some kind of warning? We'll do something like this. Alter Verwalter. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Okay, nein, ich werde die nicht abknallen. Das erzeugt nur Lärm. Could be military tags, but what do they mean? Verdammt, ich wüsste es auch sau gern, was die bedeuten könnten. Okay, die Barrikade bringt nichts. Okay. Vielleicht hat da jemand so sein Revier sozusagen abgegrenzt. Hat klar gemacht, Leute. Bis hierhin und nicht weiter. Looks like it's still intact. Locked. Na toll. Gas siphoned, tires removed, engine parts missing. Looks like this thing has been stripped clean. Hm. Das hat jemand benutzt, um äh, Ersatzteile für sein Auto wahrscheinlich zu besorgen. Must have been a hell of a wreck. Und ich meine, das ist schließlich schon das zweite Auto, das wir in diesem Zustand gefunden haben. Okay, 
Only things didn't go as planned. Ja, wahrscheinlich war jemand dann zu voreilig und schnell gewesen. Zu überhastet. Und hat dabei Scheiße gebaut. I'll just have a look around, okay? Okay. Kenny ignoriert uns. Not exactly a welcome banner. Okay, 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 okay. Great. Needs a quarter to work. Dann vielleicht am Zeitungsstand jetzt. Von wegen Geld und sowas äh, hat ja keinen Nutzen mehr. Oh, können wir uns dann vielleicht auch eine Zeitung holen? Alter, warum? Na toll. Seht ihr das auch, dass es manchmal echt komisch aussieht vom Bild her, wenn er dann irgendwie so wie, wie doppelt zu sehen ist? Still locked. Okay, okay. Mit ein bisschen... Das ist so, wie wenn man einen Fernseher repariert. Da muss man auch ein paar Mal gegenhauen. Sag ich doch. Macht zwar nur Hölle Schlärm, lockt die Zombies damit an, aber hey... Alles okay so weit. Äh, mit Sicherheit. <lacht> Der Reim war unfreiwillig. Der war unfreiwillig. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the what the hell is that? Fate worse than death. Okay. No sign of any boots down there. Schauen wir uns mal gründlich um. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. Okay, okay, das hilft uns alles nicht weiter. No docks, no boats. Verdammt. Ist denn nichts da? Irgendwas muss doch... Oh Mann, das wird Kenny echt nicht gefallen. What the hell? Get down! Get down! Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? We didn't come here looking for trouble. Yeah, well, it seems to have a way of finding us anyways. Look, this could be the guy from the radio. The one who's been messing with us. If he is, we can put an end to it. Right now. Okay, Nein, das ist nicht der the 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 street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. Ist abgehauen, wusste ich doch. Ah. Hey, hey, ich hab gedrückt, ich hab gedrückt. Das ist ein Mädel. Ich wusste doch, dass das nicht unser Funkgerät-Typ ist. Es ist eine Frau und kein Kerl. 
You're not from Crawford. Okay. You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Full marks for observation. Kenny, don't! No, he's with us! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Who the hell are you people? Everyone just calm down. I'll calm down once she tells me who the fuck she is. Back off, asshole. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. <laughs> you guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No. I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. What's the deal with this Crawford place? Are you sure you want to know? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Okay, um... Do you know who's been rigging those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who's been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Das war so klar. Es sind zwei Personen. The on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. 